That shit was stable or hardcore? Probably. Definitely not hardcore. Maybe casual. Or, or maybe standard. Casual or standard. Alright, hello everybody. We're about to play the very scary. Well, hopefully scary. Oh, I don't know. We haven't played it yet. But probably. What's it called? Resident Evil Village. Long Village ago, of Shadows. Long ago, a young girl went with her mother to pick berries for her father, who was hard at work. But the forest greeted them with a dark, cold silence. The bushes empty. Yet determined to find the berries, the Rasko broke free from Mother's grasp and vanished into the trees. Mother's worried cries faded fast as the girl ran on, over vine and under branch, and into the forest deep. Feeling strange eyes upon her, the girl recalled Mother's scary bedtime tales, and her throat became bone dry. <clears throat> then the Pat Lord appeared. He greeted her warmly and bit his own wing. Come, child, quench your thirst, he said. So she drank the thick, dark blood and smiled with joy. Passing through the graveyard, menacing storm clouds loomed, and the air turned bitingly cold. The girl was shivering in her thin clothes. Then a dark weaver appeared, and with a click of his fingers, crafted mist into a beautiful dress. Come, child, warm yourself, he coaxed. So she clothed herself and smiled with joy. Across waters deep and ominous she went, hoping a boat she found would carry her home. But hunger's grip tightened and her heart grew heavy. Then the fish king appeared and offered one of his many fins. Come, child, eat your fill. So the girl ate and smiled with joy once more. Continuing on, she soon entered the forest's dark heart. Then an iron steed appeared, bearing a beautiful golden gear. The creature said nothing as the girl approached and snatched what she thought was another gift. The horse grew angry and summoned the other monsters. Terror filled the girl's heart as the wild wind rose around the beasts. Suddenly, a witch appeared, dark yet regal. Gifts we gave, but more you took, she snarled. So more in turn is due. In a blink, the girl was trapped inside a mirror. There. Why well, that baby's got a big She's head? Asleep. What is with the creepy story? She's only six months old. Woman at the store said it was traditional. <laughs> a local tale. Besides, Rose doesn't seem to mind. Because she doesn't understand it, thank God. We moved here so that she wouldn't have to deal with any of that, remember? There's nothing wrong with my memory. You're just right. paranoid. It's not... Never mind. I'm sorry. <laughs> but I'm not paranoid. I'm just cautious. Then, go cautiously take your daughter to bed. <laughs> I'll finish dinner. It's okay, Rose. Your mother doesn't want to remember it. I can't blame her. Did you say something? I mean, was Nothing. it? I'll put her down. Was it really that Just bad? Just say that you were crazy. <laughs> Once you're a big girl, we'll have a drink together. All right? <laughs> I mean, we can have some now. Mm-hmm. Oh, you're making me dizzy. Photo. Three years ago, I couldn't even imagine something like this would happen. <sighs> Our taste in music's definitely improved over the years. You mean mine has? What does this say? 
Miss Misty and the Palm Boys? Is that a real band? I'm gonna get you hungry? No? Maybe later then. We'll go put her to bed. I don't want to. I don't, want don't get too close to me when I'm cooking, babe. Are you okay? Don't drop the baby on the stove. Hey, Why is there what are you door? doing, mister? They're heavy drinkers. They have so many rolling carts. Rose's food, February 6th, rice cereal, banana puree, 7th, sweet potato puree, boiled spinach and cream. Ethan, don't give her any sugar or honey, and no mushrooms. That's sad. Rose's half birthday. If I gonna have mushrooms, I'd be angry. Her birthday will be here before we know it. They grow up fast. Let's just enjoy it while we can. Yeah. <laughs> Once things huh? warm up, we can go for a walk. Hey! Keep it down. Just making sure it's locked. She's going to grow beautiful. Shut up, baby. There, there. It's like I said to your mom. That book's too scary for you. That book's too scary for me. It gave me the heebie-jeebies. Ooh, nice bathroom. Jeez. Me is medication. Yeah, she acts like she needs medication. Your mama and I love this song so much. Side. They could use a drum solo. <coughs> Gotta do a deep clean before Rose starts walking around. <clears throat> a historical look into the architecture of Eastern European castles and keeps by George Trevor. Is that her bed? Curtain closes on the Dolby gas incident. The committee completed their investigation on the 18th into the Dolby toxic gas leak in Louisiana in 2017. They concluded the deaths were caused by a leak of natural gas that had built up in the mud rock under the area. Jack Baker, 57, and his family who were exposed to the gas perished. Ethan Winters and his wife were also believed to have been nearby, but their current whereabouts are unknown. The entire area has been closed off by officials who believe it will be at least 10 years before the area is habitable again. Everyone's forgotten about this already. Of course they did. It was just a gas explosion. But we know what really happened, don't Almost we? there, honey. Sweetheart, don't you worry. 
I'll be right downstairs. Daddy won't let those weird fairy tale monsters get you. You promise? Mm-hmm. <clears throat> February 6, 2021. Me and I had another fight. I accidentally mentioned what happened three years ago and she blew up at me. We finally settled down in our new life in Europe and can bring Rose up properly, but I still feel like a part of me is trapped in that hell home back in Louisiana. I know Mia doesn't like to talk to to talk about it, but can we really just forget everything and pretend it didn't happen? Shouldn't we face what happened there so we can live our lives with Rose without it hanging over our heads? We 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 owe her that much at least. I know Mia knows this too. She wouldn't have exploded like that at the hospital if she didn't care. Oh, so they're in Europe now. Name Rosemary Winters. Wait, what? I thought the note on the fridge said Feb her February her half birthday was in February. Anyway. That's, she was 14 and a half pounds when she was born. Good lord. She was pretty tall, too. But 14 and a half pounds. Good lord. Rose is fine. Rose should be ashamed. Rose's favorite toy. Gun survivalist. A heavy firearms. Blah, blah, blah. I wish it could stay like this forever. Well, that was a boring book. The one at the beginning was better. She doesn't get a blanket. Marmar, stop reading so loudly. <clears throat> Is she okay? Sleeping like a, uh, well, like a baby. Hmm, <laughs> that smells good. What's that? Oh, hands off, Mister. It's <laughs> chile de legume. It's a local recipe. Wow, you've gone full native, haven't you? Mm -hmm. Local wine, too. But if you're gonna keep sulking all evening, maybe you shouldn't have any. You really have to stop worrying. It's just finding you in Louisiana, the pregnancy, Chris moving us here, military training, it all happened so fast, you know? Well, at least we're all together. You, me, Rose. Now, everything's gonna Seriously? be- Seriously? think we can just forget about what happened in Louisiana? It happened so long ago. I just, I don't understand why you are so- <laughs> Mia, get Shit. down! Mia! Good lord. I got shot like 20 times. Oh, God. Oh, 
Chris? What the hell? Sorry, Ethan. No! What? I mean, she's already dead. Why? Right? You never know. Is this really happening? Well, I did not expect that. Go on, move! All clear. Rose? What the hell are you doing with my daughter? Package secure, sir. Take him away. I said get your hands off her! Ethan, no. Rose. Get him off. This just got crazy. Just a bit. Hey, Doc. Hey, Doc. Hello, Mr. Winters. I got your daughter's results back, and I'd like you to come in to talk about that. How about the next Thursday, 4 o'clock? No problem. We'll be there. That was the Doc. She'll see us next week. Hey, now. Think positively, positively, all right? right? We, we talked about, about this. this. I, know. I know. We hardly we talk about anything else. I, I keep telling you, it's not Rose that I'm worried about. Well, then what are you worried about? Look, she's going to be fine. I just know it. What else matters? We matter, Ethan. You matter. You just Mia, what are you talking, are you talking about? about? Is there something you're not telling me? Come on, talk to me. Damn it. I have to take this. Oh, my little angel. With the fat head. Where's Chris Redfield? And Rose? Who is this? This is a secure channel. You are not walking out of the <laughs> Fuck. What the hell happened to you? I don't know. It's cold. Mission objectives. Eliminate target. Recover body. Secure Rosemary Winters and Ethan Winters. With the two Winterses... Win, win, Winterses... To site C for further investigation. At least two transport officers to accompany them. It's useless. So, somewhere cold. Her van flipped... I guess that guy got shot. Was there just one guy or two guys? Okay. It's supposed to be two guys. Ellen's probably driving. You probably can't look at him.
Way to go, Ethan. That's his name, right? Ethan. Yeah. Where's it at? Ethan. What? Sounds like a bear. Is that blood? Or is it just ground? Birds! Bird blood. Oh jeez. I love running into this. Oh, you're in luck. Oh god. Those birds will start quoting at you. It's creepy. Man, it's really dark. Good thing you have a flashlight. Think someone's in there with you? Mm. Huh? You just stepped on stuff. I bet it's somebody. Or maybe maybe a tiger. We have to go downstairs. There's a fox. I'm scared. You'll be alright, maybe. Be brave. That's a big owl. You got this. Ew. What? Dude. Yeah. So lovely. What is that? I don't know. Is that like Mother Mary or something? Or Up there. Mm -hmm. Sounds like something big, like like a car or something. <laughs> what? Come away. What's this? Uh, I don't know. Can't get through that. It's a tough. 
blanket thing. Curtain. Garlic. Oh, right. I think this one has like vampires. What? Oh, the bookcase fell over. Over the armoire. Yep. Why is it bloody? I don't know. Fresh. Mm. Oh, that mouse. Oh, poor little mousey. What did all this? I don't know. She. You figure it out, Ethan. Is it daytime now? I'm assuming I'm going the right way. Where the Ooh. hell am I? Mm-hmm. Well, certainly not in Kansas. <laughs> I wonder if he's still in France. They were in France, right? Didn't they say that? Why did it... Oh, she was speaking something that sounded like French. That's a strong looking horse. Maybe maybe they're out. <laughs> yeah, maybe. Sure, yeah. Somebody got angry. Mm-hmm. Dang. Like you. I got angry like you do. Half hole. Oh, is it what? Is it half or whole? There's that picture again. <clears throat> Whoa, is something moving? I thought I saw something moving. Maybe it's just light. That's yellow, so we probably can do something to it. And some kind of other item. So we need a lock pick and some kind of other item. There's a... Um, there's some... Uh, Hey, maybe you can find a needle in there to use as a lockpick. Mm -hmm. uh. Ah. Gross.
You know, this could be a really nice little place if they would take care of it. But they've just really let it go go downhill. I think it might be locked. I figured I'd try a few times. Doesn't hurt, I guess. Is that what? What, what just happened? Hmm. Do it again. Beds look like they have like a person rolled up in a blanket. Are there people on the beds? No. It wasn't good for the goats. Locked you to missing homeowner. Business now. Yeah. Did Whatever they just it breaks. Run out of the house? Maybe. I don't know. Why does he keep asking us all these questions? Yeah. Cut something else. Yeah, show that table who's boss. You won't be messing with us no more. Yes. Right, first aid med. I mean, whoa, we have so much space. Right off the bat. Shit. Watch your language, young man. <laughs> what was that behind you? Is that something you already looked at? Friendly. Who are you? Who sent you? Nobody. There was an accident down on the road and... What's going on? Dragons? Oh no. Oh yeah. They're coming. Who is? What the hell was that? Do you have a gun? What? Please tell me you have a gun. No, why would I? I have a knife. If you give me your gun, I'll have one. Take it! Take it! No. I'm not very good at this. Hey, 
Are you listening? You're doing fine. Hey! Dang, he got got. Shit! Yeah, he probably shouldn't have just stood there. You big dumb dummy. I'm trying to hear what comes next. Dead body? You are right, though. Wait, there's more. Wait, what just happened? You got drugged somewhere. Into a room full of bodies. Jesus Christ. Dude, you look rough. Are you okay? What the hell is wrong with this place? Uh, There's something back there, Maven. Just rub some of that first aid on it. will be fine. I'm like a zombie. No. Yeah. Shooting it. All right, he killed it. What the hell? It took a ton of bullets. Yeah. We have four bullets left. Great. <laughs> they have a shortcut. Okay. <laughs> What a punk. What? So where are you? I don't know where. Where I... were you? I have no idea. That's what I'm trying to find. I thought, didn't you just walk outside from the room full of bodies? Is this the same house? I don't know. Was that it? Was that in the attic? I don't know. He's not there anymore. How's your hand? Pretty bad. Ugh. <laughs> God, that's rough. <laughs> Kim flew in a ride. Man, everything looks oh, different. Oh man, they're this finding one. us. We're getting a bunch of stuff. Yeah. We're gonna need it, that's for sure. <clears throat> and the last one, number seven. Didn't it have like first aid spray? Like you'd get bit and you'd just be like whoosh, spray it on your arm no matter what happened, you get stabbed in the neck, spray it spray it on your arm. I think so. All better. Oh, did you say that? I did. Is that a dog house or a chicken house? It's small. I don't want to go in there. Just, just do it. It's okay. You got a knife and four bullets. Uh, 
Oh. I don't want to do that. Okay. I think I do. Nothing. That's good. I mean, oh. Nine. All right. in this game. That's what's scary. <laughs> your health is at. I'm not sure. Uh, I say we just wait. I mean, you just did something, didn't you? Didn't you heal or something? It said right bumper to um, restore health. Oh, my hand. <laughs> Trying to listen. It's just, it's just me when nobody was even talking. <laughs> <laughs> so how do we know which house is Louisa's house? Okay. Where are we? Oh, no. People wow. sound American. We're back in Marco? Not in Louisiana. Oh, you're not sneaking. You no sneak. We all over you, bruh. <clears throat> Where 
Wait, where'd you go? Somewhere. He's scared, he ain't gonna do nothing. Stay down. You better stay down. There you go. There you go. Ooh. Better go inside. There's no end to them. Gunpowder. All right. What just happened? What's happening? What is that? Flower bags. Attach. Attack. Flop. What is that? Sweet. Attack flower bags to create a cloud of cover. We're shooting arrows. Flaming arrows at that. You better not stop.
All right. Well, I guess so we're cool all now. So that for for this. I, I guess so. Can I go back on the stuff I missed? I guess. That would be great. Thank you. back. It's just so heavy ring. <laughs> yes, that hurts. It shouldn't hurt anymore. You poured some of that stuff. Yeah, yeah, there you go. All better. The rest of your finger left. Wait. Hey, uh, lady. Lady. Get back here. Are you Louise? Somebody tell me what the hell's going on. Please. Achievement. Survived the lichen attack. I don't know if I survived it. I think they just let me go. Yeah. But why? I don't know. Maybe they just wanted to prove a point. Be like, don't don't start nothing because we we get you. But now that you know, now that you've seen, we're okay. I th and you know, I think technically in that time you you shot them before they attacked you. I think they did attack you earlier, but that and but. In this altercation, I think you attack first. But now everything seems to be seems to be cool. Maybe we're friends. Yeah, best buds. I'm not sure where I'm going. Just around to collect stuff, right? Been in there. Oh, and I found everything in here. Well, who knows? Usually in these games, it's hard to find everything. been through here, right? I don't know. Yeah. And in death, we give glory. Uh, hello? You shouldn't be out here. It's not safe. What the hell? Hey, can you hear me? Oh, it's you. The child's father. Child? Hey, wait. Do you mean Rose? Is she here? <laughs> Rose! Rose, yes. She is in great danger. Since Mother Miranda brought her to the village, we have fallen into darkness. What are you talking about? The monsters? The castle bell heralds danger. They're coming! <laughs> no. Wait. Where's Rose? Who's Mother Miranda? The bell tolls for us all. Oh, They're she's locked in the coming again! <laughs> Rose is here. 
here? Well, it must be a good thing. She seems pretty happy about it. <laughs> Do you want to keep going? Oh, uh, this might be a good stopping point. Yeah, seems like it to me. We we'll go pause it. Are you gonna pause it or stop it? I thought you were gonna say bye. Oh. Bye. <laughs>